Let's start with the question. My PC detects PS4 controller as an audio device. I'm trying to connect PS4 controller to PC but it goes under audio. So it doesn't work. I tried remove the device from audio. But it just goes back when I try to add it under something else. What can I do? So how can we solve this? There are five possible answers. Answer 1. After plugging it in, try going to set up USB game controllers in control panel. Also can be searched with Cortana. If a controller is listed, click properties. See if it is recognizing your inputs. If it is recognizing your button pressing, you should be good to go. From here I used DS4 Windows to configure the controller. Set your actual audio device as default. That way the controller doesn't prevent you from hearing audio. Answer 2. Simply disable the controller audio device from audio device settings. It worked for me. Answer 3. I found this on answers. Microsoft. Com. Thank you Kapalaya. The below worked instantly and error free for me. To use your PS4 controller as a game controller. You would need to download a driver. For it. Download the driver on this link. HTTPS colon slash slash github. Com. J's 2 Kings. DS4 Windows. Releases. Download. V1. 4. 52. DS4 Windows. Zip extract the content of the compressed folder to a new folder that you will create. Double click on the DS4 Windows. Click on Program Folder to install the drivers and your PS4 lightbar should lit up blue. Note, each time that you will use the controller, you would need to open the DS4 Windows app first. Asterisk Answer 4. The way I resolved the issue is going to setting up USB game controllers via typing it into Cortana. Which is also available from the control panel. Selecting my PS4 controller then clicking advanced and setting it to my preferred controller. Hope this helps. Answer 5. The easiest way to connect the controller to a PC is using Bluetooth. To enable Bluetooth on the controller, you need to first disconnect it from any device it is connected to, which can be done by simply turning off that device. Next, you must ensure that the controller has turned off completely. The light is not lit or flashing. Then, hold both the PlayStation button and the share button until the light on the controller is flashing rapidly. At this point, the controller should be visible as a Bluetooth device. And you simply need to select it on your computer. However, it is time limited. If the light stops flashing before the PC has completely paired with the controller, it will generate an error and stop the pairing process. Note, this does not work on all computers. I hope these answers helped, and if they did, please drop a comment and subscribe.